YouTube. What's up guys? It's your boy James back with another video and today I have an unboxing for some early Air Jordans that don't come out for a few weeks from now and I think that these sneakers are going to be a problem. These are sneakers that I wanted ever since I saw the official images like months back and I knew that this was going to be a sneaker that I was going to pick up like no matter what. It was just something that I knew that I needed to get into my collection but I got to give a special shout out to the homie Jay the sneaker guy for hooking me up with these early pair of Air Jordans. I appreciate you my guy. Thank you so much. Before we get into the video, I just want to take a moment out to thank all my returning viewers and subscribers for once again taking the time out of your busy life to stop over here and watch another one of my videos. I appreciate you guys. But if this is your first time visiting my channel, my name is James and I make content on sneakers, gear, and sports related items. And if you like content like that, you can stick around by hitting that subscribe button and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss anything. All right guys, so here's the box of early Air Jordans that we're gonna be looking at today. But before we actually open up the box, I just wanna say that I knew that this was a must cop for me. Months and months ago when I knew that these were coming out, I knew that this was a sneaker that I absolutely had to pick up. Now, I know that these are gonna be a problem whenever they officially release. Like, a lot of you guys are gonna catch L's on this sneaker in my opinion. It's probably gonna be one of the better releases that we've seen from Jordan brand in 2021, in my opinion. It's a definite must cop for me. This is one of my favorite silhouettes of all time by Jordan brand. Definitely something that I knew I needed to get into my collection. Now, Jay the Sneaker Guy did send me these, and he sent them really, really quick. I got them super fast. And uh, I normally don't speak on YouTubers on my YouTube channel or anything like that, but I'm a big fan of Jay the Sneaker Guy. And I don't think a lot of people realize how much work he actually puts into his content, and I'm a big fan of it. Uh, it probably takes him forever to produce a video. I mean, it takes me forever, and I don't do half the editing that he does. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I mean? Salute my guy. I'm a big fan, and thank you for sending me the sneakers. All right, guys, so let's start opening this box and see what I got inside. I just know these are going to be straight fire. These are going to be so dope. And I already got them, so I ain't got to worry about trying to fight all you guys when they come out. I'm already going to have a pair. All right, so this is packaged really, really well. Got some bubble wrap over the box. And you guys probably know what it is right now just by the box, guys. So you got the yellow box. This is a different box from what they normally put for these sneakers. And let's take our first look at it. Oh, <laughs> so dope. Oh, yeah, we got Jay the Sneaker Guy business card right there. our first up close look at the Air Jordan 4 Lightning. If you guys aren't already subscribed to Jay the Sneaker Guy, after this video go over to his channel, subscribe to him. Uh, he has a lot of really dope content if you're not familiar with him. Also follow him on Instagram, on his normal Instagram or his uh, JTSG Closet Instagram. I will link all of those down in the description box. Now the box that these sneakers are coming in is pretty cool. It's definitely different. So shout out to Jordan Brand for doing something special for a special release. But normally they give you like, you know, just the black uh, lid and stuff like that. So here you're gonna get yellow with the black Jumpman and stuff. So that's pretty cool in my opinion. And here's a shot of the size tag guys. And I'm not exactly sure how much these sneakers are going to be retailing for at this time. I've heard 200, I've heard 220, but I'm not really sure at this time. But either way, these are gonna sell out, gonna be a major problem. But yo, these are fire. These are so, so dope. So, so dope. And these really, really pop, man. These are really nice Jordan 4s. Uh, it's probably gonna be Jordan 4 of the year. It's either that or the University Blues. I'm not really a big fan of those unions that just came out. Um, it's just not my style or anything like that. But these or those University Blues are definitely gonna be Jordan 4 of the year in my opinion. And uh, I'm not gonna do a full detail review in this video, guys. I actually don't have a lot of time today, but I just wanted to bring you guys this unboxing. Uh, I'm going to be doing a full detail review and on feet of this in the next couple of days and uh, you know continue to look out for that video but I'm just so happy to be able to get this into my collection these are so so nice so nice and uh, for all my Pittsburgh people out there this is not going to be for us like as far as like trying to match like your Steeler jerseys and stuff like that I know some of you probably already think that but this is like a different yellow like as you can tell by my shirt this is a university gold which is more like a Pittsburgh color and this is more of like a tour yellow. Um, let me see, what does it say on the box as far as color blocking? We got, yeah, tour yellow, dark blue, gray. So if you can tell, like it's just more of like a brighter yellow and stuff like that. But 
I mean, definitely, definitely. These are gonna be a major problem. These are gonna sell out. Right now, the resale prices for these are really, really high. Now I know it's before the release and those will probably come down a little bit, but Jordan 4s are always reselling for high numbers. So I expect these to be, these are gonna be up there, guys. These are gonna be a problem. And if you have to pay resale, it's probably gonna be a little bit of money for you to get this in your collection. Just keeping it 100% honest with you guys. But these, in my opinion, are a must cop. I'm glad I was able to pick them up. Shout out to Jay the Sneaker Guy. I appreciate you, my man. Thank you for sending me these early Air Jordans right here. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about the Jordan 4 Lightning. Is this a cop? Is this a pass? Is this dope? Or are these trash? They're not trash, though. They're, they're definitely not trash. But you know what I mean? Let me know what you guys think about these right here. I'd like to thank you all for rocking out with me and watching this video. I appreciate each and every single one of you guys. And keep an eye out for my full detailed review and on feet for the Air Jordan 4 Lightning coming very, very soon. And until next video, peace.